Uh oh. What a mess. Hi. Trying to get my camera straight. Now it's lopsided. Hey guys. Thanks for the thumbs up. I'm tired. I just got home. Just got the dogs fed. Trying to get things set. Hey Anita. How are you darling? Oh, I've missed y'all. Hi, Linda. Hey, Raymond. Yay. All right, don't be doing that. Go on. <coughs> Scram. 15 in the room. Pig, <coughs> go lay down. <coughs> Not over here. Get back over there on the pillow. Sorry. Hey, Marilyn. Oof. Hey, Bev. Sorry, I just saw your name, baby. What a day. Hi, Nan. How are you, darling? Oh. The dogs are bugging me. They're mad at me. They want my attention. All mine. <laughs> Got my phone plugged in. Everything should be good to go. Not gonna be long. Hi, Ma. Hi, Pops. I got my tea. <sighs> Have y'all had a great day? This, my, my house is a hot, hot mess. There will be no thrifting tomorrow. Tomorrow I am going to clean my house and I intend on doing the tour tomorrow, I hope. I'm gonna do my best. It's either thrift or tour. Is that okay with y'all? I've asked you three times to scram. Y'all talk to me. Hello, where's my friends? The tour, yeah, hey junk lady, how are you? Yeah, my fall tour, so y'all can see how I put all my thrifted treasures around in the house. Hi, Wendy. Cool. Yep. I'm going to try. I'm going to do the kitchen and the living room. Yep, that's what my plans are for tomorrow. That way y'all can see where I've put everything. I mean, y'all can see my buffet. So. Hi, Sam. Hi, Sam. I got your package today. Thank you, darling. I haven't, I cracked it open and I saw one thing and I'm going to do a video on it. I want a giveaway with Sam and uh, the Invisible Thrifter and I'm going to open it tomorrow in a video. That's something else I got to do tomorrow. Thank you, honey. But if you could see the house right now. Hi, Leah. It's been a day. I was really dumb, dumb. I was up until 4 a.m. And I'm tired, but I missed my friends. I missed talking with my friends. Buddha, you're a mess. I really need to tend to my animals, too. They're a mess. Gotta get their winter cuts going. Ugh, and a bath. Dogs are a lot of work, and when you got six of them, it's treacherous. <laughs> hey, Linda. Thank you. That little uh, hot chocolate pot's precious. Now I've got some snowman mugs I'm going to put out with it on like a little vignette. It's going to be really cute. Oh. I just want to curl up on the couch and take a nap. <laughs> hey, Sherry. Yeah, Buddha's beside me. Pig curled back up. Puddin's over here, uh, Squeaky, Mickey, and Packy's across the room. They're a mess. They, I'm ashamed of them. They need taken care of. <sighs> yeah, I mean, I've been doing some scissor cuts on them, but I'm, I need to finish them. I do them as they pile in my lap, you know what I mean? <laughs> it's rough. Do I look as tired as I feel, guys? Ugh. 
I don't know what y'all, what do y'all want to talk about? Y'all want to, y'all want to know anything about me? Hi, Linda. Yes, they're brothers and sisters. Pig is the daddy. Molly was the mama, and y'all know I lost my Molly dog, and boy, do I miss her. When I come home from work, I drive, I have a circle drive, sort of, and I circle around where she's buried, and I always talk to her. Ah, uh, yeah, no doubt. Yeah, would you would have think that I would have thought that I would have gotten more rest? Yeah, I don't take them to a groomer. I do it myself. Hey, Leslie. And it's, you know, my husband used to help me, but where he is, he can't help me anymore. So it's on me. And then Jordan used to help me too. But Jordan moved out, so John Michael doesn't want anything to do with them. John Michael's Yeti, in case y'all don't know. I call him Yeti. Just a little family thing. That's, I just call him Yeti. This is one of my shirts I got. It's a polo. I like this one. It's comfy. But it isn't as comfy as jammies. How's everybody's weather? Is weather cold or warm or what are y'all doing? We had sunshine today. It was moderate, but it's, you know, as the sun goes down, it starts to get real cold. I'm not a winter girl. I don't like it cold. Hey, Cheryl. How are you, darling? Would you cut it out? I can't wait to, <clears throat> oh, oh, I've gone blurry. I can't wait to open the package from Sam. Hey, Marilyn. Yuck, poor thing. Yeah, I bet. I'm not, um, hey, Italian teacher. Thank you, honey. Where's everybody from? I know Raymond's New York. I know Mildred's Cali. Um, Anita is, is New York. Oh, baby. Oh, wow. How sweet. I'm sorry. I know how it is to have to lose one. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Hey, Tammy. You're in Oklahoma. Maryland's in Tennessee. You in the mountains of Tennessee, honey? Cheryl's in Dayton. Oh, boy. Y'all got hammered with that uh, tornado. I'm sorry, baby. I hope it didn't affect you. <coughs> You're in Ohio. Yes, I see that from the box, love. <laughs> hey, Stitchy Rebel. You're in Michigan. Yonkers, New York. Okay, Westchester County. I went to the city. Um, gosh, I got, it's been, it was three years ago this summer. Oh, wow, thank goodness for that. I know one of our friends, Joseph, they had damage. Hey, Mary. I'm so glad you're here. Bartlett, Tennessee. Hey, Marilyn, did I speak to you, baby? Hey, Janetta, how are you? Look at my friends coming in to say hello to me. I am so blessed to have y'all. Y'all just don't know how I truly feel. Bolingbrook, Illinois. Is that near Chicago? Sweet Linda. Hi, Mommy. Hey, Kim. Welcome. I had a friend from Natchez, Mississippi when I was in high school. Yup. That is close. I knew some people from Chicago, and I probably don't say it right. My husband used to say Chicago. I say Chicago. When we were kids, we were taught um, a chicken in a car and a car don't go, and that's how you say Chicago. <laughs> Hattiesburg. Is that, uh-oh, is that Pennsylvania? I'm sorry, I read it wrong. Ah, uh, oh, you're so sweet, baby. Thank you, Raymond. That's very sweet of you, honey. Hello, Dollar Tree goodies and more. What's your name, baby? 
Welcome to Tam Fam. Sorry, y'all hear my neck crack? Oh, time to curl up. Mrs. Oh, Hatt I'm a dumb dumb. Hattiesburg, Mississippi. Okay. You know I'm a dumb dumb. Chicago. <laughs> uh, my geography isn't on point, but it's a whole lot better than my Jordan's is. Jordan was really bad. He said Baltimore, New York. It's like, no, son. No, son. Thank goodness. Yes, I am. Boy, the best thing about Monday is Tuesday's my day off. <laughs> That's sad, isn't it? <laughs> You're close to Memphis, Tennessee. Home of the King, right? And real good barbecue, but not as good as North Carolina barbecue. Sorry. That's just my opinion. I'm a vinegar-based girl. Grew up on North Carolina barbecue. Luray, Virginia, you're you're not far from me. You know that, right? Hey, Judy. You know you're not far, right? About what? About an hour and forty-five minutes. I've been to the caverns, Luray Cavern. It's beautiful. Y'all y'all ever heard of Luray Caverns? The stalactites and the stalagmites? I have two boys. I lost three children when I was, you know, um, they're in God's hands now. I've never met them. One day I will meet them, I hope. <laughs> I have two beautiful sons. John Michael is... Uh-oh. One was born in 91 and the other in 92. So I think, what are they, 28 and um, 27 and 28? I call them my eyes. Jordan's my right, John Michael's my left, and without them I cannot see. They fill my heart. Yes, girl, and hot sauce. Don't forget the hot sauce. I put conditioner in my hair last night. Look at that stuff just to shine in today. Works for me. I don't always put conditioner in my hair. I just never have. We didn't have it when we were growing up, so. It's still in my head, so it ain't fall out. So. <laughs> Do y'all know the difference between stalactites and stalagmites? Not you. You know who I'm talking to. Y'all know you know. They're the things that, that grow in the caverns underground. Y'all know the difference between stalactites and stalagmites? Yes, they are. Uh, they mean the world to me. You know they do, Ma. Oh, somebody asked me about this electronic device. Over here, see where my finger is, the, the screen in the background? Hey, Joni, Joni, Joni in the house, guys. Um, That's my, I don't want to say her name because she'll wake up. Yeah, I know, waiting for me to get there to see him. That's right. A stalactite <laughs> holds tight to the ceiling and a stalagmite might make it to the ceiling one day. That's what we were taught many years ago. Ugh. I had a request to move my, my head. Remember I had a head over here? I was requested to move it, so I did. I'm sorry if it bothered y'all. Jordan painted it and I was kind of proud of it and she was my friend. <laughs> Before I had YouTube, she was my friend. <laughs> I, um... I took a picture of it one day, and I sent it to Jordan, and I told him, look, look, Jordan, I, or Jordan, I made a new friend. Hey, Stephanie, how are you, baby? Welcome in the room. Thank you for being here. 
and, and I took a picture of her. I told him, I said, Jordan, I got a new friend. I got a new friend. And he said, who, Ma? And, and I told him her name was A-L-E-X-A. -E I'm not going to say it. And I sent him a picture of her, and he just about lost his... <laughs> he laughed and laughed. She was, I know she was kind of crazy, but Jordan, I thought, did a pretty good job on her face, painting it. Ugh. We're not going to be on long tonight, my loves. I'm, you know, like I said, I'm a dumb dumb for staying up. Use vinegar? What did vinegar do for it? I used to put beer on it years ago. I can see you, Joni. We can see you, baby. Keep typing, keep talking, because we can sure see you. Joni just did a tablescape, guys. I work at a convenience, a convenience store. I'm a manager. One of two. There's the owner and me. I can see you, baby. I, it's, uh, I can't see my own comments. That's what you just wrote. And we can see you. Or at least I can. I forgot what I was talking about. You know I'm real good at that. <clears throat> what a day. I'm sorry, baby girl. Thanks for being here, Janetta. That means a lot to me. Oh. I thank everybody. Everybody can see Joni. Can't y'all see her comments? There we go. Leah sees you, Joni. We see you, baby girl. I don't know what's going on in your little crazy phone. Wait a minute. <laughs> it's hard. We're I'm a hi Marilyn. Did I speak to you? Um my the convenience store I work at. Hey Terry, I don't think I spoke to you. Um it's right off the interstate. And we get all the truckers and really top chat. Um, all the truckers and I, I live very close to a rock quarry. I mean, I work very close to a rock quarry, so we get all the dump drivers and you know all of that. We get a lot of um, landscapers and contractors. The store's been there for 30 years, over 30 years, and we have a deli where we fry chicken. We have chicken tenders and potato wedges, some people call them potato logs. And we do everything from scratch. And we also have main entrees. We do meatloaf, we do spaghetti, um, shepherd's pie, um, gosh, what else? A lobster mac, mac and cheese, vegetables, like seven different vegetables, um, uh, lasagna, all different kinds of stuff. And we have a big Bay Marie or big bin that are warmer that we keep everything in and we um you know we have to keep replenishing i mean we don't just fix one pan of chicken a day i mean we go through i think you said a thousand pounds of chicken bone-in chicken a week that's not counting the um the tenders or the potato wedges so hey kelly I might do the, um, after I get off tonight, the live, I might do the video of From the Invisible Thrifter so y'all can see the giveaway I, that I won. I can't wait to see what's in the box. I saw one little thing, and it's like, oh, this isn't anything that I ordered because I had like five or six packages today that I, I've been bad. I've been on eBay buying all kinds of stuff. But I'm going to do a haul on that uh, once I get everything in. 
Yeah, it's it's you know, and we have a grill. We do hamburgers. We um, the BLTs are bomb. I eat, um, eat a BLT almost every day. Um, we have sub sandwiches. Sorry, Joni. I know you don't like it. We have hoagies. That's for you, Joni. Hi, Julie. Where have you been, you sweet thing, you? You all right, baby? Hey, Sharon. Welcome from Florida, baby. You nice and warm down there? Really? Hi, Jody. I'm a little pooped, but, you know, I missed my friends, and I wanted to come in and say hi to everybody. Let's see. We do tuna, we do egg salad, we do chicken salad, barbecue, um, you know, any kind of hoagie or sub that you can think of. We do Philly steak our way. <laughs> For the rest of the year, absolutely not. My bank account would think I'd flipped out. Hi, Becky. Welcome, baby. We got another Tennessee person. Yeah. <laughs> Mine. <laughs> a lot of people say that. I'm just greedy. <laughs> Not really. I give you the shirt off my back if I thought it would help. Oh, no. Oh, that's not fun. Let's not talk about that. I used to be an instructional assistant for three-year-old children at a public school. I know what you're talking about, child. No. Absolutely not. Ah, uh, yep. Yep, from the beginning of time. Since Cinderella came to the ball, Ma and Pop have been here. A lot of y'all have. And I'm, I'm, you know, thanks for sticking with me. Yeah, I know, right? Yuck, yuck, yuck is correct. Eh-eh. <laughs> Eh-eh. God bless you. Mm -mm. I had to cut my hair and everything. It's like, absolutely not. Uh-uh. If I see somebody digging in their head, I walk the other way. Um. Eight years, nine years ago, maybe. Yeah, I cut about 12 inches off of it. I, had, I call it a Britney moment, and I had it in a ponytail, and I told my husband to hand me the scissors. He didn't think I was going to do it, and I just took the ponytail, and I went, chop, and I sure did. I cut it. Oh, wow. Oh, that's awesome to know. Did you see that, Julie? Suave coconut shampoo. Give that a try. I hate having to put all those chemicals on your head. Yeah, I don't want to cut mine. Hi, Ruby. Um, well, the last time I colored it, Jordan did it, him and Will, and they pulled it through a cap. Hi, Lavender. How are you, sweetheart? You all right today, my friend? Been thinking about you, baby. A cap. Can you imagine pulling all of this through a cap? And and that was um, three years ago, maybe. Oh, it was a mess. Oh, boy, isn't that fun? My mother-in-law brought them to us one time. She had gone down to visit her family in North Carolina, and she lived with us at that point. We were taking care of her when I lived in Roanoke. And I, this is ridiculous. Why are we talking about this? Um, it was Christmas morning, and I was under the tree, watering the tree, and, you know, and it's like, what is this? And sure enough, my husband and my brother-in-law went to the pharmacy that day and were picking stuff up to take care of business because it's like, nope. My husband didn't have an issue because 
he um, he used a lot of hairspray. And for some reason, I'm not saying the word. For some reason, they don't like hairspray. Right? No doubt. No doubt. Really? Oh, God bless you. Thank you, baby. Jody, that's awesome of you. But did you have dark hair before you went gray or white? I know. I'm. That's like... Oh, boy. Hey, Michelle. Yep. Sharon, did I speak to you, doll baby? I don't know that I did. If I didn't, hi. I'm 56. My birthday. Now, y'all got me scratching. Um, my birthday is in July. July 9th. Long, I don't, well, you see this is not curly. The only reason it's got these waves in it now is because um, I keep it braided up at work. Some, I used to, you know, y'all you know, see me have it pulled up on the back of my head. <clears throat> That's how I come. Hey, Becky. Thank you, baby doll. I appreciate it. Joan is here. She's on her other phone. Thank you. I'm glad, you know, like I said, I put that conditioner in it last night. She got a little bit of a shine going on today. But the ends, not so much. Jordan needs to come. I want him to come on a full moon. They say he'll trim it for me, or will. But they say if you trim your hair on a full moon, it grows faster. I'm one of those people. I believe in superstitions and stuff like that. <coughs> I'm from the country. <coughs> <coughs> Pardon me. Ah. Uh. Lord, have mercy. <clears throat> right? Trimming on a full moon? Yep. They say it grows faster, so I'm all down for that. I've always wanted to have long hair, so. What did I miss? What did Raymond say? Oh, sweet pea. I'm sorry, Raymond. I'm here for you. When signs are in the head. I don't understand that. I am real. You know, I am what I am. They're all around here. I've had to shoo a couple of them off. Oh. Oh. They're a mess. Y'all don't want to see them. They're a hot mess. They need attention. They're here. I don't understand that. We'll grow slowly when times are in the feet. I don't get that. Uh-oh. Hey, Sharon. Get back, Buddha. Thank you. You haven't done, you better get that video going, Sharon. Sharon's going to do a jewelry jar, and she's going to do a video of it. Go check her out when she gets it posted. Yeah, somebody asked me to move it. It bothered them. They said she was distracting. Hi, Debbie. Oh, really? Okay. Oh, honey, I can tell when the moon has changed because the people go nuts. When the full moon, oh, boy. The moon, mm -mm. people are off their charts. I like the head. I mean, you know, normally when I was sitting on the other couch, nobody saw her because, um, you know, she's over here. But now that I changed my living room around, and y'all really haven't seen it since I changed the living room around, she's over here by the machine. No doubt. 
Boy, honey, you don't want to buy one from Goodwill anyway because they're off. They're terribly. They are beautiful, but people are whack. <laughs> when the moon is big and bright, people are nuts. Mickey Mouse, come here. Come here, Mickey. Come say hi to everybody. Get up here. Come here, Mama. Come on. Mickey, up. Mickey Mouse. Come here. I'm here. I'm here. Buddha, you're dirty. Uh-oh, you tagged me on a question and answer. Hey, Southern Belle. This is Mickey Mouse. Hi, Mickey. What you doing, buddy? Six babies on a full moon. That's Mickey Mouse, guys. Y'all don't see him. See, I gave him his little haircut. He's got some scraggles. Buddha, wet. He just drank water. So he looks cute. I'm not ashamed to show y'all him. Yeah, there's one of them. Oh, we got a. He's got a bump on him. Uh, uh we'll take care of that later, huh? Uh huh. I know he didn't do bad. His ears turned out really cute this time. He looks most like his mama, I think. With his haircut, he looks a lot like his mama. And I miss her. I really miss her. And Buddha just jumped over here. And if he knocks anything down, because I've got stuff from my hall still sitting over here because I'm lazy like that. And if he knocks my stuff over, he's going to get in big fat trouble. Yeah, that's what they are. I, I, I. Yeah. The spelling is a little different, though. I think it's S-H-I-H-T-Z-U. Yes, he is. But, well, between him and Mickey Mouse, they're, they're, they're pretty big. I think Mickey's longer, but Buddha's fatter. Hey, Rosemary. Uh, oh, yay. I'm so glad you're here. It's late there, I know. What, you're like five hours, uh, uh, five or six hours after me. Hi, Scrapper. How are you, Miss Canadian Scrapper? You got another one. Oh, Mama got to take care of you, big boy. Yeah, huh? What did you tag me in, Debbie? Hi, Cammie. All right, so... Oh, bless your sweetheart. <laughs> Overworked. That's Mickey. I'm going to hold him up for y'all. That's him. I'm doing all right. I'm a little tired. 125. Sweetheart, thank you for staying up for me that late. I'm a Southern... I am a Southern Belle. <laughs> all right, this is Fat Boy. Look at him. Look at him. He needs grooming. Oh, look. Oh, that's Buddha. Oh, my stars. He's heavy. And he's a mess. Thank you, Raymond. 19 questions about myself. Oh, boy. Okay, I'll do the tag. All right, get on over there. Uh, oh, he's coming back. He said, no, ma'am, uh-uh. Hey, Karen, how are you, honey? Welcome, welcome. So now I got Buddha in my lap. Oh, yes, you're so stinky. You says a stink boy. Stinky, stinky Buddha. This is Martha Posey's favorite. She loves Buddha. Hey, Barb. Cheeto and EV. Hey, Carmen. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Southern Belle. That's sweet. I'm doing well. I'm like I said. I'm I'm a little tired, but that's my own dumb fault. I was up till four a.m. like a big stupo. Oh, are they now? What does that say about me, Raymond? I'm just kidding. <laughs> 
My little girl's over there on the other couch. Packy. Packy. Kissy mama. Packy. Come here. They want to say hi. Come here. Pat Pat. Come on. Buddha. Gosh, she's heavy. Sit there. There her he is. There her he is. There, Packy. Ugh, because I'm a goober. Look at her. She did she said, no, don't don't do this. She needs look, she needs her face cut too. They're all gonna end up looking sorta of like Mickey Mouse. Huh, sweetheart. This one's squeaky. Here they go. Hi, hello, hello. And now I can't read the comments, guys. I'm well, so glad you're here. You're a scrapper, Canadian scrapper. Does that mean you're a thrifter, or what? It, what is it? What does your name mean, love? Hello, my children. Mama loves her babies. Yes, I do. Oh, Jiminy Christmas. I know, right? It's like my lap is big, but it ain't that that gum big. Oh, Buddha, don't you dump nothing over now with your big wide self. Yes, I love YouTube. I love YouTube. I love everyone that I've, most everyone that I've met. Hi. And it, it, it fills me up. I like, you know, I don't want a bigger lap. They can wait their turn. <laughs> um, I told y'all a million times before, you know, I used to just come home, cut on TV and vegetate, eat and vegetate and now, I come home and I think about YouTube and what I can do for YouTube. Scrap metal. Okay. I got some here at the house. Um, you know, and it just, I've, I've made so many friends. I, well, you got friends, Leah. You got friends. I'm your friend. I'm your friend. Unconditional love. You're exactly right, Debbie. Yep. It has brought me out of my shell, Ma. It certainly has. It certainly has. You know. I used to play music when I was young, when I was 16. I've always been very insecure. Hey, Lisa. Hi, AK. Poor AK and I cannot get back together with our schedules. It's been... We're trying. We're trying. Judy, did I tell you hello, love? Thank you, sweetheart. That's very sweet of you. My son has a cat. Sandra, did I tell you hello? Lisa. Hi, sweetheart. Well, honey, you got friends now. Everybody welcome Miss Canadian Scrapper to our, our, to our family. Hey, Ray Ray. Raven's in the house. We are all friends here. We are all friends here. Hey, Nancy. Y'all are y'all are precious to me. I mean that. Yeah, welcome our friends into the room. Our family. You're Tam Fam now, doll baby. Welcome in. I like doing lives more than I like doing videos. Um, just because I get to actually communicate with y'all. Doing a video, it's, you know, I love doing videos and, and doing tablescapes and stuff like that. But it's, I gotta scroll back. But, um, hey Marcy, I didn't see you sweetheart. Um, it's, it's more personal, hi Ruby, to be able to talk to y'all if I can see, you know, who's, I don't like missing y'all. Nope, there's no way he'd do it, absolutely no way. John Michael has already told me that I'm not allowed to do, um, video while we're having Thanksgiving. It's like, well, I wouldn't do that anyway. Why are you having a bad few days, Canadian Scrapper? What did you say your name is again, darling? 
Yep, absolutely. One big family. I'm not rested and I'm not bright, that's for sure. <laughs> I'm tired and I was up till 4 a.m. because I'm a goober. Hi, Rosemary. I wish y'all could see this dog the way she's laying in my lap. Well, baby, we're glad to have you. We're all friends here. Thank you, baby. Thank you. Sometimes when I'm doing, you know, a, recording a video, sometimes it takes four or five tries before I get it right. And it's like, you dumb dumb. But when I'm live, it's if I make a boo-boo, I've made a boo-boo, and it's there. Eva. Evie. Evie. Okay, Evie, I'm going to try to remember that. I'm really bad, but I try. If I forget, understand. Um, yes, uh, it, and y'all know, I'm just, if I make a boo-boo, I make a boo-boo. Thank you, baby. Yep, I like to let her loose sometimes, so I don't like to have it binded up all the time. Fancy. <laughs> Raven! <laughs> I love you too, Raven. <laughs> Y'all, I'm just playing with Raven, and she knows that. Yep, ever, yep, full of love. If you're a hater, get to going. Hey, 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 Barb. Going on grumpy in the house. Thank you, thank you. I've got some cool, cool plates that I bought for Thanksgiving. Hi, Miss Jo. <laughs> Y'all stop calling me an old hag. <laughs> An old hag. Barb, you kept me up till 4 a.m. That's what I was doing. I was talking to Barb. <sighs> That's okay. I don't mind. <laughs> Uh-oh. Here comes Squeaky. Old ball butt Squeaky. This one's Squeaky. Barb, going on Grumpy, guys, she's the one that sent me the gorgeous windmills and the angel. Raven, I'm going to get you. I got your number, too. It depends on the winter. It, 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 we can. Um, yeah, it's Barb. We'll blame Barb. Not really. Um, it, sometimes we can get a clipper, and it'll come to us. And, you know, we've, we've gotten quite a bit. It just depends on the year. And y'all are going to think I'm crazy again. I haven't seen a lot of acorns. So hopefully we'll have a mild winter. We'll see. Wait a minute. Lero was the one that tagged me, and I tagged you, Joan, and Mai. You got to tag three people. I'll try. I'll try. I'll definitely do it, but I don't know who I can tag, but I'll try. I'll try to get it done tomorrow with the other multiple tasks that I have to do. And once again, don't expect a thrift haul from me tomorrow, guys, because I am determined not to go out of the house. Too much to do. If y'all want that fall tour, I've got to get this place in, on point. <laughs> I don't know what to say it for. My Shih Tzu's? Uh-oh, they're going to they're gonna get me for that. Mine. <laughs> They're mine. Mine. Oh, Lord, no. Mm -mm. <coughs> nope. 
Ah. Oh. Ma, you're a sweetheart. You know how I feel about you. I love you to pieces, and you know it. Oh, if you don't see a lot of acorns, then it's going to be a bad winter. I was always told if a lot of acorns fell, then animals could, um... How do you know who's a troll? Um, well, you can tell because they say very nasty things. Or, you know, they're very rude. And, you know, that's normally, you know, you know, you know. Hey, Pat, I'm glad you're here. I think they're sweet, too. I think they're sweet, too. They're my babies. Yes, you are. Are you mama baby girl? Y'all got, look at my shirt. Look at my shirt. You got gunk on me. You got gunk on me. Oh, well. I love them gunk and all. Quit smacking me. She wants my attention. What time is it there? Oh, yeah, I've not really seen any squirrels, but... What, Queek? Oh, okay, lay down and behave, because that's enough. Ugh. Oh. Are you leaving, WD Mommy? WDW Mommy. Bye, baby girl. Thank you for being here. I can't believe we got 65 in the room, guys. Absolutely. We get them out as soon as we see them. When I'm moderating on Joni's channel, and sometimes with her channel, it goes so the chat goes so fast. 9.40 a.m. I'll be still sleeping at 9.40 a.m. tomorrow morning. Mm-hmm. But the chat goes so fast, sometimes you make a boo-boo. And um, I've done it multiple times. But, you know, I'd rather somebody make a boo-boo than have to be able to keep a nasty troll in. Because, you know, they, they get very, very ugly. Oh, yeah? Well, the people that are in blue... Oh, my gosh. Hey, thanks, Barb, sweetheart. Thank you very much. Um, if the person is in blue, then they have the ability to either put somebody in timeout or hide the comment or hide the user from the channel. It's, um, I can't see the time here. I can't see the clock. But, yeah, so, you have to, um, you have to, a lot of people, that's why some people don't do a lot of, of commenting, because they're scanning the chat, so they can make sure that nobody's in here being ugly to, to your host, me. So, it's very important to have moderators, because there are a lot of crazy, crazy people out there, and the ones in blue with the wrenches are moderators. I think everybody in the room has the ability to do that, but the moderators can can really throw them the heck out. I've been fortunate. Well, it, it uh-oh. Janina, is that, did I say that right? I'm so sorry. Welcome, Jan I, oh gosh, please I said it right. Janina? Oh, that, well, I'm glad it's after 7 here, because if after 7, it means I got to get off work. You're in cold Washington State, aren't you, Lavender? Hey, Barbara. Oh, good. Whew. I hate saying somebody's name wrong. Uh-oh. Uh. What a day, what a day, what a day. Uh, uh, Jerrietta, hi. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Everybody welcome our new friends. It's Janina and Jerrietta. 
I'm glad y'all are here. Welcome. Wait a minute. What was that? Yay! And didn't you say Gina? And Debbie Ross. Hey, Debbie. How are you? Thank you. I'm really bad lately about answering the comments. I hope y'all forgive me. It's, you know, I'm real bad. I try to give everybody a heart at least. I have to go back and do that because it's just... Geretta? Geretta? Uh-oh, uh-oh, I'm sorry. Nothing? Honey bun after a while or pack of nabs? I love you too, Barbara. I'm just overwhelmed sometimes, guys, with work and coming home and looking at the way my house looks right now. It's really awful, and I can't stand it. Yeah, Raven, me too. I'm so sorry. I've done something to my arm, and I don't know what I've done to it, and it's been hurting for a bit. Thank you for being here, Sandra. Yeah, look for, I have a, a friend mail, and um, I have to look into that tag to see what that tag is. So, uh, I got to do that one. But I'll get it done. What? You got a physical, oh, you got physical therapy tomorrow? Yes, ma'am, I sure do. Hey, Shelby. Hey, you know what? You're right. Hey, Lane, how are you? Good to see you, honey. I understand. Yep, yep. It's just so much. I don't, you know, I feel like if I take time off, then I don't want to let anybody down. I think about others before I think about me, and that's just the way I've always been. That's just how I roll, guys. Hey, Tony. Welcome, baby. Nothing. I'm just running my, you know, flap, flap. Y'all know how I am. I just talk. Tammy, did I say hi to you if I didn't forgive me? I think I'm going to give that shoulder massager to my mommy for Christmas. She's, you know, she had a strokes. Are you going back to school, Lane? Are you are you back in school? And and mommy mommy's in a wheelchair. So I was thinking about, you know, she always needs her more than me. So I might just give it to my mommy. Ah, cool. Good night. I think you said Gina. Good night, Scrapper. I know that part. I can read that. I hope so. I hope, you know, Mommy's hard to buy for. And yeah, I call her Mommy. I'm 56 years old and I still call her Mommy. Ah, you're on to regular Joni now. Yay. Well, it's easier for me to do it probably tomorrow because I'm off. Are you going to, Jaretta? I just get lucky sometimes that I'm just fortunate that y'all like what I find. <laughs> I have bought some um, really cool things from eBay. And I'm going to do a haul on that. I'm um, adding to my Corningware collection. I can understand. I can really understand. But it's good to see you in the room again. I've missed you, honey. Yeah, I'm real bad about it. I don't. She's in a center and I don't go over there like I should. And I shame on me. 
shame on me. But I'm just, I do, you know, she's, she's my mommy and I love her. But, you know, she understands that with my work schedule, it's kind of crazy. And when I get home, it's, you know, it's, it's late. And the truck's been, I'm making excuses, aren't I? Hey, Michelle. Thanks for being here, darling. Yeah, I like corningware too, but I like the blue cornflower. Y'all know what I like. I'm glad you're back. I, you know, I do have some of the spice of life, but that's what Yeti is allowed to use. He is not allowed to use my blue cornflower corningware. Nope. Oh, thank you so much, Barbara. That's really sweet of you. Thank you. I bet y'all do. Sharon, you gone too, love? Night, Sharon. Hey, sunshine. Thank you, baby. Yeah, I like the cornflower blue, too. Yeah, you know, I've got a lot of stuff in here. Y'all will see. When I do the house tour, y'all will see. And I'm not going in the bedroom. Mm -mm. Nope, the bedroom is off limits. It's, what you doing back there? Don't you act a fool. Don't you do it. Don't you, don't hit me in the face, neither. You be good girl. What? 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 I love you too, baby. Be good. No biting of the pro, you know. Don't groom. Spoiled rotten. I put conditioner in it last night. Thank you. They're um they were thrifted. Every that bowl that they're sitting in. Joni gave me that. And I put the sunflowers in it. And that's a rooster with the bowl. And right now I've got some uh, leaf candles that I thrifted. <coughs> and they're sitting in that. Packy, you're to behave. You are to behave. Look at her trying to hit me in the face. <clears throat> no, ma'am. That's why you can't be back there. Mm -mm. People get offended when you groom. You sit in my lap. <clears throat> Thank you. I love it too. Oh, do you really? Um, well, I'll tell you the story about it. Sandy, did I tell you hi, baby? I don't know that I did. Um, I was come I, when we lived in Roanoke. Uh, my husband and I, well, Roanoke is a, a different kind of place. And if you don't want something, you can sit it out on your curbside, and it's basically free game. That wasn't like that here in where I'm from, in Richmond, or my area that I'm from. Stop. Um, so I was coming home from work one day. Ah, uh, hey, Coco. And... I was driving down the road, it was almost at our house, and I saw this buffet, but they had antiqued it. They had painted it white, and I told my husband when I got home, I said, go get it. It won't be there long, and I want you to bring it home, and we're going to take care of it. So he went up, and him and my son... And it was close enough where all they had to do was walk it back down to the house. And we had a bigger house then, had a split-level house. And he brought it home, and we stripped it down and refinished it to this color. It's got wooden casters on it, wheels. And um, they're not on it right now. They're put up. But then my husband one day, it had a long, has a long drawer in the bottom where you pull it out. I was at work one day, and my husband split the drawer, the drawer face, 
and made doors that open. Oh my gosh, when I got home and I saw that he had done that, I was devastated. It's like, what did you do? Oh, you've ruined it. So it no longer has a drawer. It's got doors that I could have popped his noggin. It's like, why did you do that? You ruined it. And then I've got the little bling bling knobs on it. Look, wobble wobble because I need to glue them down. They're, the stem is too long. Oh, yeah, and we're not going to talk about Reggie. Mm -mm, we're not going to talk about poor Reggie. Joan's devastated, and as I would be. I know how it felt when I lost my Blue Delph. And I know it's it's a sick feeling in the pit of your gut. And I, oh, God bless. We're not going to bring up bad memories. Guys, it's I've been on here a little over an hour. Y'all want to keep on chilling a little bit longer? Or y'all want to say good night? Y'all make the call. Y'all know we're just we're just wrapping on, that's all. Hi Mary. Thank you. There will not be a haul tomorrow. I'm going to stay in and I'm going to do everything in my power to do the fall tour. Because Thanksgiving Day, after my, my Jordan and Will, well, Jordan has left. And, hey, Mary. And um, John Michael goes to work, because I'm sure he'll have to go to work. I am going to break out Christmas. Ah, you're sweet, Sharon. <clears throat> I'm so, I keep kind of trying to crack my neck because it's I'm stiff. And I'm holding packies in my lap. Packies in my lap. <laughs> oh, y'all are so good to me. Thank y'all. Well, what do you want to talk about? Deborah, what else is in the tag? No, I'm not either, but Thanksgiving I am. Night, AK. Oh, it's a mess, baby. And I still haven't forgotten to, that I need to send you a picture about where I sent my camera. Yes, we do. But I think I'm only, I don't know. I think I just want to get a turkey breast. Because with it, just questions. Okay. With, um, with, um, the family, we've only got four. And if we get a big old turkey, I don't want all those leftovers. I mean, you know, I would make turkey pot pie or something like that with the leftovers, but it's just so much. You do a fried turkey, deep fried? I mean, I could smoke mine if I wanted to up at work, but, um, oh, did you? I like ham. I love ham. But my boss normally gives us that for Christmas, maybe. I don't remember if he did last year or not. But I prefer ham than to turkey. But December 1st. Well, my thing is I'm supposed to be off, supposed to be getting off Wednesday at 4, off Thursday, off Friday, off Saturday, off Sunday. So that's kind of the, uh, sorry, that's kind of the time that I will have. I'm going to do everything in my power to get it out. So, I mean, it's like I kind of have to do it. Yeah, it, it just, well, my turkey ain't dry or tough because I shove it full of butter and <laughs> keep butter in the top. Yeah. Hey, D. Welcome, girl. I figured you'd be in the bed by now, sweetheart. 
You find the darndest things. D, I'm looking for a Corningware holder. If you see one, let me know. Cool, Joni. You j oh, just got in the bed? I know that's right. <clears throat> yep. You know, the, the metal cradle? I'm looking for that. So if you see one or if you have one, let me know. I've got a, my fingernail needs filing. I can feel it. You have some? Well, email me or you know I'm not good at emails. Message me and let me know how much you want for it. How's my cat? How's my binks? He's been hiding and Sophie's been getting the limelight. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I don't blame you. Well, Jordan can't, Jordan thinks, wait, where are you going, Buddha? You see me? I, I'm full of them, too. Um, Jordan said, Mom, you come in here for Christmas? Binks isn't naughty. He's precious. And it's like, um, no, you come home for Christmas, uh, for Thanksgiving. You, you come home. As long as I have a home... You come into it. For some reason, we've gotten, I've gotten really white and bright, and I don't know why. <clears throat> I think we're going to go for maybe another 10 minutes or so, and then I'm going to go because nature's calling. Hi, Linda. Thank you. They're, they're, Annoying. They're annoying, but I love them. Yes, indeed, spiral. I don't have a fireplace. I have to cut mine on the TV. You know what my mom used to do? Because my dad was a hunter. Turkey TV dinners on Thanksgiving. Turkey TV dinners. And then we would have Thanksgiving dinner on Sunday because it wasn't hunting season. Turkey TV dinners. Are you kidding me? Pass. I know, right? No. Turkey TV dinner. Peas and carrots are an instant potato. No. Nope. Mm -mm. Not mine. Yours. I don't want that. Instant potatoes. I know, right? Right? No. No. Who wants a TV dinner? But, but, they're gross. Well, my mom could cook, you know, and but she wouldn't cook Thanksgiving because Dad was out beating the bushes hunting. It's like, um, well, no. Uh -uh. Good night, Becky. Thanks for being here, darling. Whoops, missed something. That stuff is disgusting. Yep. Oh. No, I'll be here. You know, I'm I'm going to do probably do a video. I know it's be cold here too, but Jordan's coming. Jordan and Will will go to his family. Good night, Raymond, honey. Thank you for being here. And, you know, I, I might do a video of, I'm definitely doing a video of my tablescape because, like I said, I bought some really pretty plates that I intend on using. And um, I might show you what all Jordan's supposed to be cooking. Good night, Tammy. 
Yuck, no snow. Yuck, keep it. Mm -mm. Don't want snow. Ugh. Somebody said something about pneumonia. Oh, really? Thank you, Pat. You're a sweetheart. Mm. Yep, five minutes, guys. Five minute countdown. And then we're going to roll on out of here. And I'm going to take care of business. And I'm going to get a honey bun. I don't have any milk. I want some milk. Have to settle for tea. Are you? Well, like I said, John Michael has said, would you sell? Would you sell, D? That I'm not allowed to do a video of us eating. It's like no kidding. I don't do mukbangs. No. This is not... Mm -mm. Night, Mary. Thanks for being here, darling. What'd you sell, D? The mixer. Oh, nice. Nice. Did you go back and get that other piece? You too, J uh, J Janana. Gosh, I hope I said that right again. Night, Terry. Love talking to you too, honey. Thank y'all so much for the thumbs up. Love you, Joni. I'll talk to you after a while. I don't have any milk right now. I didn't get any from the store. All right, guys, let's roll her on out right now, then. Let's all go so I can go to the ladies' room and meet up with my friend Philip. Y'all know who I'm talking about. I love y'all. Thanks for coming and popping on and talking with me. I've missed you, and I just wanted to pop in and say hello. <laughs> all right, start rolling it down. D, go back and get that other Pyrex. Love y'all too. Night, Tam fam. Night. Thank y'all so much for being here. Y'all are great. Sweet dreams. I'm going to count to three, guys. I'm going to count to three. That's all she wrote. Night, night. All right, you ready? One, two, three. Love y'all. Peace. Thanks, Debbie.